So the problem is my crystal restroom tank get too hot during the summer and the solution would be put a fan on top and air and just blow air on it. it, it evaporation will bring down the tank temperature. So in here you can see that now it's at 71 degree uh, which is ideal temperature for the CRS but if it rises to be 74 or 75 it's going to be problematic. So when it rises about 74 75 the fan better turn on. I did have a fan here right but um, it's not smart enough right I don't want to turn it on and off any uh, sometime anytime it uh, the temperature rise right so I need to build in an automatic system so this is my bill is now the current uh, I have a probe a temperature probe in here the current temperature right now is at 22.2 Celsius yeah some reason this one cannot display uh, Fahrenheit but 22.2 Celsius is about 70 degree F or se around 71 I guess 71 um, Fahrenheit um, so 75 degree uh, Fahrenheit is around 23.8 Celsius so if if when the probe detect the te water temperature rise to 28 point uh, 23.8 Celsius the fan should kick on all right, so to simulate that, I would just take the probe out of the water, hold on to it. Our body temperature is about 30, 37 degree Celsius. Yep, you see that? So the temperature rise rapidly, the fan kick on. And now, I'm gonna put it back in the water, so the temperature is gonna drop again. And when it drop under 23 something, the fan should turn off. There you go, see, right when the, the, the uh, temperature hit 23.8, it turns off. Alright, I'm going to cut it here and install it on the tank and see what happened. Alright, so this is how I install it. The fan goes right here. Uh, maybe I should cut this thing so it doesn't go out all the way here. Um, and then, I put it inside a Tupperware. Now I say 22.3, but in here it say 71, so 22.3 is about 72 degree uh, Fahrenheit. It's a little bit off, but who cares, right? It's just one degree or something. Um, that's a probe going there. Let me test it. Get the probe out. Hold on to it. See the number is increasing. Yeah, the fan kick on. And you see that it's quite some air going through. Hopefully that is going to cool out the tank real fast. Alright, let me put it back in. Now the temperature should drop and it should stop. There you go. Yep, alright. That's a poor man's solutions for a tank aquarium chiller.